hello everyone welcome or welcome back to my channel i hope all is well with everyone today i will be bringing you a what's in my bag featuring this cute little bowler bag that i received in friend mail from sassy sonne she's here on youtube thank you so much sassy this is the sandstone fashionista bowler bag this bag is available at burlington and some of you may be able to find it in your tj maxx it just depends I will give you a quick look around the outside of the bag. I do have my little wild pom-pom that I picked up here from the Dollar Tree a while back. You do have the billboard with the Juicy Couture print across the front here in the color. It's like a pink, peachy pink, but more like a light macaron color. I do have this pouch attached here, which we will go over in a few seconds. You do have the Juicy Couture print all over the bag. This bag did come with a longer crossbody strap. And as I stated previously in other videos, I do not like the Juicy Couture straps when they're made like this. They just feel cheesy to me. But I did remove it and I did place a strap that I already had um, on here in place of it. And I think it goes well with the bag. This strap was purchased from Amazon. Okay, so you do have the crossbody option to carry along with the top handle option to carry. There's the back of the bag. The bottom of the bag is in that pink, peachy pink color along with the zipper and you do have gold hardware. Here in this little pouch here on the outside, this was a five below purchase and this is a Kindle and Kylie pouch. And inside of it, I just have my hand sanitizer from Bath and Body Works. And this is the Ice Dragon Fruit Tea. All right, I'll give you a quick overview before we start. That is how I have it packed. And I'll just start pulling here from the front in the two slip pockets. In the first slip pocket, I just have my whipped hand cream from Bath and Body Works. I also have my Carmex Comfort Care lip balm, and this is in the scent Watermelon Blast. In the other pocket, I have my AirPods case. Okay, and I'll just start pulling here from the main compartment of the bag. I have this little card case, which I removed from a lanyard. And in here, I just have my insurance cards here on the front. And my ID is tucked here in the back behind the card. Now, I found these pieces a while back. I want to say at least six months ago, maybe. May have been a little bit sooner, but I've had them for quite some time. And I never could find any pieces to match that had the white lettering on them. So I was wondering when or if they were going to come out with a bag to them. Next, I have this card case by Juicy Couture. And I did haul this case a while back. This is called the White DeVos Half Zip Card Case. And there you have the cute little, it appears to be like a little lock with a heart on it on the zipper pull. I thought that was really cute. On the back here, you do have three card slots. They are pretty spacious. You can get at least two cards in each one. I just have my bank card and a couple of credit cards. I don't have anything in the side slot. May use that for receipts. And on the inside, I just have some cash. Okay, the next thing I have tucked here in the corner, I have these little organizer cases. These were purchased from Amazon and inside of here, I just have a couple of items on hand that you may need. Sometimes I have some Tylenol, some Ali, some Purell singles, some alcohol wipes, one of the compressed expandable towels, some chewing gum, and a couple of cough drops here on this side. Now you can use this little case for many different things. You can put small hair accessories, medications. Just whatever you need, you just tweak it for your use. 
Next, I have this cute little pouch here that came with the macaron backpack that I have. It's also Juicy Couture. And I am using this as my cosmetic pouch. And inside of here, I have my EOS lip balm. And this is in the scent Vanilla Bean. I do have a two-sided mirror. That was purchased from Shein. I have this cute little um, lip balm or lip gloss from Timu. Show you guys how it looks. It's really pretty. It has the little flower on the inside of it. I just thought it was really pretty and it matched the bag so well. Next, I have my nail care kit. And here I just have some glue, some nail clippers, and a nail file. I have my perfect perfume spray by Marc Jacobs. I have my Sugar High Butter Gloss by NYX. I have this cute uh, lip gloss, and this was a Timu purchase, and I just thought it was cute. And this is, I think, the peach one. Let's see. Yes, this one is the peach flavor or scented. Okay, I also have another lip balm. I picked this up from Five Below. And this is the Caramel Mocha flavored lip balm. And you just take the top off. Now, I do have my um, lip applicator inside the bag also. I'll show you that now. And that's this here. This was picked up from Timu also. So that I, I don't like to have to stick my finger in the lip balm to apply it when I'm out. And I have my Mega Clear Mascara by Wet n Wild. And last, I have my lip liner. I mean, eyeliner. And then my lip liner by NYX. And I think this one is the Peekaboo Neutral. Okay, that's everything I have in this little pouch. I'll get everything placed back in real quick. Okay. Next, I have this little pouch. And this was a Timu purchase also. This white little mesh pouch. And I'm using it as my bathroom pouch. And inside of here, I have this cute little Crayola. This is a body wash pen, but the soap is not too bad in it. So I am using this as a uh, hand wash, hand soap while I'm out. I just thought this was really cute. And I did see Pink Sparkly Chick show these on her channel. And she pours the contents out and use it for other things such as lotions or if you want to put your own soap in here, you can. But I just thought this was really cute to have. I also have more of those expandable towels in here. I have my soap sheet. I have my macaron uh, pill case. And inside of here, I think I have my allergy pills. I have another hand cream, the Shea Better hand cream by EOS in the coconut scent. I have my band-aids from the Dollar Tree. I have some Kleenex. And I have my usual wipes inside of here. Just my regular wipes. Panty liners, wet ones, antibacterial wipes, and a couple of Purell singles drop down inside of here. Many of you that have been watching me for a while, you see it's pretty much the same. Other than the packaging, I don't switch up much on these items. Okay. All right. Next inside of here is this pouch here. And this is the other item that I was telling you guys about that I found a while back. 
and I hadn't at that time was not seeing any of the pieces with the white lettering on there and this is in the macaron color also and I did cut the little straps on here they were too long and in the way inside of the bag and inside of here I'm just using this as like my little stationery I do have my little notebook in here along with a few ink pens and I do plan to add a couple of more items if needed, such as highlighters and sticky notes. But these are the ink pens that I have. Many of you have seen these several times before, so I won't go over all of them. And that's everything I have in this pouch. And that's everything for the main compartment of this bag. And real quick, I'm going to show you all this. We're just about finished. It's the same setup. The black and white print with the gothic lettering. Two slip pockets here in the front and a zip pocket here in the back. And in this back zip compartment, I just have my stylus pen. This is one I've had for a long time now. And my Dollar Tree flashlight. All right, so that's everything I had packed inside. Give me a few seconds, so I'll be right back to get you guys a look at what all I had. Okay, guys, I also forgot to mention I will have my phone in there, and this is the case that I will be carrying on this phone. And this was, I think, a Shein purchase. So that's a look at everything I had packed inside. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment. Subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next one.